We just played miniature golf at the Lumberjack Mini Golf Course, which is in Hayward. It's right across the street from Hayward's Lumberjack Championship Arena. Really cool. While we were playing, they actually had a show going on across the street. And you can see a couple of guys actually shimmying up the poles like a race to see who could make it up to the top first and who could make it back down. Pretty neat area, especially when you learn, like in our minds, we're in the middle of nowhere in northern Wisconsin. But anybody that's really knows this area knows that the Lumberjack Championships are held here. If you've ever seen Lumberjacks on ESPN2, yeah, that's happening right here. How cool is that? So we're hanging out with my cousin Abby and her husband Levi. They live near the Hayward area. And so we've been going to church with them in this area and then came up here for some mini golf and just to spend time with family. Now, after mini golf, we are gonna go get some ice cream. The downtown area is a neat little eclectic downtown where they've got like two or three ice cream shops and some candy stores. And today is Kira's half birthday. She is how old? Eight and a half. Eight and a half. We've always celebrated half birthdays with our girls because their birthdays are so close to Christmas. So it was an opportunity in the past for us to get them like a bicycle or a skateboard in the summertime. Now that we're living in the RV, things are a little bit different, but we still try to celebrate those times. So Kira's gonna get to pick out some ice cream and some candy. Normally I would only say one, but it's your half birthday. Yes. Plus I'm gonna step as a light fairy. I was gonna be a Pikachu, Instead, I'm a light fury. Yes, mom got her a How to Train Your Dragon Light Fury dress slash costume. It's so cute. Use <laughs> game. So while we were playing mini golf, on one of the holes we were at, what I thought was a squirrel just goes running across the green. And I got a good look at it. I'm like, wait, that's not a squirrel. Oh my Is that a squirrel? Yes. No, that's a, that's a parrot. What? You don't see those very often. And Levi says, oh, that's a ferret. And I'm like, wait, that's an option? You can have wild ferrets? Sure enough, they have. I thought it was a chipmunk. Yeah, she thought it was a chipmunk, but it was, I, I got to look at it. It was definitely a ferret. They had wild ferrets here in Northern Wisconsin. How cool is that? And how often am I going to say, how cool is that? Kara, go sit on the moose. Okay, I'll start heading that way. That way later. Okay. Oh my. Oh my, oh my. Match the. Coconut taffy, here's some licorice taffy, chocolate caramel mocha, strawberry banana, blueberry muffin. Yeah, there was one that just said chicken and waffles. I don't want taffy. I don't think I'm going to get anything. Chicken and waffles? Yes. Wow. So you pick out the taffies that you want, and you put them in this basket, and then you take them up front and pay for them, and they'll bag them up for you. 
layers look so good, but it's like I don't want taffy because I get tummy aches. Yeah, I know. Well, see, you're like me. I don't want taffy either because I know how it makes me feel. Because it, because I, I know it's like it's still going to eat too much of it. You want to try blueberry muffin? I've definitely been experiencing some issues with eating sweets lately, so I am just gonna abstain from this. Just take in the smells and the, the scenery. I too far in case you didn't have enough. Yeah, don't, don't stray too far. All right, because I got 20 extra so if you need it. Okay. Is it everything you hoped it would be? We have a lot of candy. Oh, thank you. So how much was that, like $5,000? $67. Oh. Ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> Back in 2007, we were our son Khalil was younger, and we were in Estes Park in Colorado, and this candy shop had double salt black licorice, which is super sour, super bitter, and the candy shop owner paid Khalil a dollar just to try it, and he did. He'll do that, you know, a dollar on the line? Yeah, I'll do it. So. We were shocked, but this candy shop also had the double salt black licorice. If you're no, down for super bitter type candy. I think I need a picture of that sign there. The big Hayward sign. Are those, are those pews from church? Oh my goodness, look at that Superman ice cream. And birthday cake. Oh Mango <laughs> Italian ice. Oh my god, those are so good. It is? Yeah. Does it taste like carrots? Yep. Alright, thank you. Birthdays were really important on our family. And I proposed on her half birthday. Nice. Oh, nice. Uh, <laughs> got her in an airplane said we were going to go looking for wolves. Just like, why are we going to an airplane? I was like, well, it's the easiest way to find them. <laughs> to find wolves? Yeah. She, she was the star. And then we flew over the lake, and I had written in the snow in 20 foot letters, oh, Marry me, way. Becky. Nice. That's awesome. This must not have been an airline. Uh, no, private plane. <laughs> I got good friends. <laughs> All right, how about you? Uh, cotton candy. How many scoops? Uh, two? Give it two. I was like, how much can you put into one? Yes, please. Kayla, did you want a cream soda to drink? Yes. Do you want a drink? Uh, cream soda. Okay. I'll take it. So I had for breakfast more to love. There's a new flavor, so when I came by at 8.30, I'm like, my breakfast. Chilies. Oh, 
I'm eight years. Hey, where's the white? It's like the jams. Jams and jellies. Cherry butter. Oh my. Hello. Peach butter. Kaylin, I found a Carolina Reaper salsa. Oh. Scorpion pepper salsa. I know, I was just telling mom. Be careful, there's a bunch of grenades I just want to sit on the floor and start reading them. Cinnamon pear preserves, those are probably so good. Yeah. Goodness. A little sample. Is there, is there some fancy syrups, Tommy? Anything in here, or are you good? Good. Okay. You don't even want a syrup for pancakes? Mm -hmm. Okay. We already have syrup. All right. Ooh, look at all these thermometers. Whoa. Ooh, happy. There's a lot less people out here now. Having fun? Yeah. That was a fun day in Hayward, Wisconsin. A lot of candy shops, a lot of ice cream shops, fudge, what, I mean, oh my goodness. And here I am deciding not to have sweets anymore. Whoops, wrong day to do that. <laughs> no, but I feel a lot better when I'm not eating sweets. I had sweet cereal this morning and I regretted that. I felt like I was gonna pass out while driving. And cue the comments telling me that I need to see a doctor. So I didn't realize how touristy these areas in Wisconsin were. When we were headed up to the church, we passed by a KOA holiday. Now if you pay attention to the KOA, a holiday is more of a destination KOA. There was a lot of families there. A lot of activities, awesome playground, old water slide. So if you're staying in the Hayward area in Wisconsin, this Calvary Baptist Church is a great church. They're very welcoming and very loving and caring and they were so excited to have us here and giving everybody hugs and giving little gifts to the kids. So it was quite the blessing to be able to stop at this church. We recommend it. If you're staying in Shell Lake, it's a little bit of a far drive. The reason that we came up here is this is my cousin uh, Abby's church. So my birthday was recently and I get to pick the restaurant we're eating at today. So we're gonna try Coop's Pizza, the Coop's Pizza Parlor in Hayward, Wisconsin. And we will let y'all know how good it is. The pictures look great and it has a salad. I'm a fan of salad bars. Some people may not be, but our family, we, we enjoy salad bars. Work. 
Is it like a matching game? Coops was pretty good. We weren't expecting a pizza buffet, but they just had like a little two pizza pizza buffet thing. I knew they had a salad bar and soup. Kira had some chicken noodle soup, but it was more like a vegetable soup than chicken noodle. She was surprised to get mushrooms and black olives on her pizza. Oh yeah. There. They said they didn't do any special orders, but she, she really loves a mushroom pizza. And she went up there and there was a mushroom black olive pizza on the pizza buffet. It, it was pretty good. I would say if you're in the area, it's worth a try. I don't know that I would run to this place and be like, I have to have it. Yeah, and they also, they had pickled herring on the, on the salad bar. Yeah, pickled herring on the salad bar. gave tried it. Gave our family a chance to all try pickled herring, and I'd say we all liked it. Kaylin, Kaylin was like, eh, nah, not so much, but Kira liked it. Yeah, I liked it. It was good. All right, now we're going to go find some waterfalls at Amnicon Falls State Park. See you there.